Previously on Legacy of Fortnite Story. What's your names again? Mark, and this is my wife, Angela. Where are we? You're in a cell that I built at my outpost. What else are we gonna do? We can try to escape. You're heading north? Miller said that I can meet Grant. He knows where he'll be. We have to leave. Tyler, I'm old. I'm not leaving this place. Make the call. Send her. Rachel knows what to do. Ellie, Ellie. Rachel Wood, the commander of the Lodge Outpost. Take them both prisoner. Run to the cabin, find Grant, and come back for me. Hey, Rachel, right? Take him back to the lodge. Maisie, it's Hector. You're a monster. Maybe I am a monster after all. It's more soldiers. I want to help you guys get out safely. Go we'll hide in the attic. Death is at your doorstep. I welcome death in my home. Death is here, old man. I found a kid. He lost someone important to him. Who's that? I'm Ellie Wilson. Commander Gail Miller sent me. He needs your help. He's dying. What? Who are you? What did you say your name was? My name is Ellie Wilson. And you said you know Gail Miller? And he's... Dying. Dying. You gotta explain all of this to me. You're Grant Fort, right? Yes, and this is... Oscar Fort, his brother. How do you know us? Believe it or not, last time I saw you guys, we were kids. Our fathers were partners, along with your mother, Fergus, and the others. Wait, you're... Oh my gosh, you're Ellie! It's been so long, my f memory is foggy, but... I do remember you. That's right. Your father was Perry. Him and Dad were best friends. He always wore the detective clothes, the big trench coat. I see you've adopted the same fashion. Well, Arnold adapted the trench coat. I remember Arnold. He always used to make those cool gadgets that we would prank Fergus with. Like the one that ripped his beard off, and then wouldn't give it back until he danced in front of it. Yeah, I remember that one. Where have you and your brother been this whole time? At least, since we saw you last. Before my father died, he gave us one of his secret labs to work in. So we've been staying there as scientists, learning more about the world. Where's that? Just south of the lodge, in the basement of a mansion. One question, Ellie. What is it? How did you come across Miller? Oh yeah, Arnold and me attacked the real, not knowing that it was just taken over by rebels. We... Wait, you were the people that were dressed weird. Makes sense. What do you mean? Maisie told me about your attack right before Veronica attacked. Where is she? She was captured by Veronica and was taken to the woods outpost. Ah, uh, Maisie and Veronica, your sisters. I guess you all still don't get along? Maisie was with us. Veronica has been off by herself way before Dad died. She's never been involved with us. Well, sorry about the attack that me and Arnold did. What happened exactly? She attacked while you were gone. Wait, where were you anyway? I was talking to Tyler's father, Dennis. Dennis Anderson? Yeah? How do you know him? He was part of your father's team. You never heard of him? Not until I met him. What happened there? How did you end up bringing back a kid? It was Rachel. She came with her soldiers and killed Dennis. I took Tyler with me. I promised Dennis before he died that I would take care of Tyler. How is Tyler taking it? The best he can. I know how he feels. Oh yeah. I heard about your father's death. It was broadcasted everywhere. That's how I found out. We found out the hard way. Yeah. The hard way. Anyway, after I attacked, Miller and Tulip chased after me and Arnold to our mansion. We ended up becoming friends. Then, me and Miller decided to travel up to you. And where is Tulip? She is still at the mansion with Arnold. So how did Miller get stuck somewhere? On the way, Rachel trapped us and Miller was taken. And you said he's dying, right? Last I saw him, he was shot. I don't think that's the last Rachel is going to do to him. So, what do you say, Grant and Oscar, my old friends? Why don't we make an alliance between the mansion and the rebels? Ugh, you! You're coming with us! Just give me five minutes! You're coming with us! Five minutes! Jeez, just got shot in the freaking chest! God, give me a break, you animals! Ellie! Ellie! Tulip, I need you to do something for me. What? I need you to go upstairs and open the front door. Now. Why? Just go, Tulip. Quick. Ellie! 
Answer me. I'm doing backup plan 5B. What is that voice? Uh, I don't know actually. What does he mean? What does he mean by backup plan 5B? What did he just say? Backup plan 5B? What the heck does that mean? Okie dokie. Camera's on. Heat signal is initiated. Laser sight range finder activated. No idea what he's talking about. Stop! I seriously don't know. Calm down. I just got shot. Please! Jeez Louise! Okay, I'm sorry. It's okay, Louise. He didn't mean it. Come on, man. What is he doing? Oh, that's what it was. Hmm. Arnold. Arnold. Hey, hey. What was that plan thing, huh? Shoot it. Crap. What the crap was that? I guess that was Plan 5B. Oh, you're so dead. What is going on? Commander, you're back. What the? What is that? Another one? Wow, I guess so. You, come with me, now. Okay. Get in the car. Why did you have me open the door? Ventilation. That was fun. Yeah, it was. Let's look for them. Just drive around the area. Where are you taking me? Don't worry about it. Just go. Okay, sure. Stay up here. Don't move. What are you going to do to me if I try? Just look down. You'll see what will happen if you try. Tyler? Tyler! I'm sorry. It was all my fault. No, Tyler. It wasn't your fault. How could you think it was your fault? We... We went there, and we led her there, and she killed him. I, I practically killed him. No. Even you said it, Mr. Fort. You said that we need to go, and I didn't listen. I'm so stupid. I never listened. No. Me not listening got my dad killed. You can't put that on yourself. It just sucks, you know? Like, I feel all by myself. I almost want to be by myself. 
You're not the only one. I know how you feel. What do you mean? I lost my father about a year ago. And, unlike you, it was my fault. Completely my fault. What happened? It's a long story. You can tell me. I... Well... You guys almost ready? Yeah, Oscar. I'll be out in a sec. Wait, what, what's happening? We, um, my army commander, Gail Miller, he was captured and was taken to the lodge outpost. We have to go get him. Grant? Yeah? Would it be okay if I just, um, didn't go? Yeah. I understand. It's hard. It's really hard to lose someone that you love so much. So much. Some say it gets easier over time after you lose someone, but honestly, it just gets harder. Because you think to yourself in your head everything about that person, and you remember them. You remember their face, you remember their smile, and the sound of their laugh. It's not as hard when you think about them going away and their passing or what comes after. What makes you sad is when you think about how they laughed and smiled and you remember how happy they were with you and how happy they were when they saw your face. You know, it haunts me all the time of what happened to my father because I know that it was my fault. I carry that on my shoulders every day and night. It's the worst pain in your life. But Tyler, it's life. And we have to deal with life doesn't matter who did it or what happened. It still creeps up on you when you're the most vulnerable. I felt all of this, Tyler. All of this. I don't want you to feel like it was your fault. Because it wasn't. And look, sometimes we just have to take some time for ourselves. And if this is the time for you, then I think you should. Thanks, Grant. And hey, we're going to win this war for your father. And for mine. Create a life for us all. That's what your father wanted you to do. Yeah. Just take some time for yourself, Tyler. It might be the best thing you can do. Where are we going? We're going to the reels, and then we're going to that stupid, broken down place that you, Grant, and Oscar stayed at. The clubhouse? I thought- You thought I didn't know about it? Yes, Maisie. I knew about it. I found it like a year ago. What? It wasn't that hard to find. Why didn't you just come and kill us a long time ago then? Because. Why? Because I don't kill people. You just killed Hector. Oh, good job, Maisie. You caught me in another lie. I'm such a liar. Yeah, I know I killed Hector. That was to prove a point. And it disproves your current point. Whatever. I was never going to kill you. I would never kill my family. Do I have to repeat that? I will never kill my family. You're trying to make yourself sound better, but you're not. You never will. You're a bad person, Veronica. You need to accept that. I might not be as bad as you think. What are we doing here, anyway? I'm taking something from all of the soldiers' bodies. They have something that's useful. What is it? None of your business. Sure. Okay. Hey, put your hands up. Stop. Hey, just put your gun down. No, Macy. I'm going to save you. Looks like I'm going to have to kill you all. That was...
was... That was the rest of our soldiers. They were living people. So what? Everybody dies. Now be quiet. Let me do what I need to do. Here. You gonna kill me? No. Why? Veronica assigned me to find Grant Four for her and I failed. So I'll bring her you instead. It's just one more prisoner she can have. Why? What do you mean, why? What are you doing? What is the point of all this? I don't know what you're talking about. Why are you doing what you're doing? You sound like the old man that I just put a bullet into. I would watch what you say. No. I'll say what I want to say. You can't kill me. How much you want to bet? You said it yourself. You won't kill me because you failed Veronica. You don't want to fail her twice or you might be the one getting a bullet to the head. Whatever. What even made you the leader in the first place? How? You're young. You couldn't have been serving for very long. My parents died. That's all you're getting. You're the only person who has got that much info. Food will be up soon. At least before I send you to Veronica. Okay, Rachel. Think anyone is here? How would I know? Not sure. This is nice, Maisie. It's trash looking, but it's nice. I can see why you guys liked it so much. Yeah. What's that place? Oh, it's also trash. No need to look there. It's just filled with a bunch of junk. It's where Oscar lived. You know how he was. Let's go check it out. Do you see them? Either of them? Nope. Just trees and grass. Do you hear that? Stop the car. It's another car. It's coming towards us. Shh. Sounds like they just heard us. They stopped their car too. Ellie? Tull up? Hey, put your hands in the air. Stop in your tracks. Who are you? Who are you? Grant, stop. Ellie? This is Grant Fort. I made it to him, and I told him about us. Ellie, you're alive. Yeah. Why didn't you call me and tell me? I must have lost my calling system back at the scene where Rachel caught us. Miller was taken by her. He's a prisoner at the lodge right now. That's where we are now. Who is all we? Me, you, Tulip, and Grant. And his brother Oscar. We knew them when we were kids. Oh, now I recognize them. Except the eye patch. It wasn't a choice. It's a long story. What are you guys doing out here? We were looking for you. Oh, well I'm fine. So how do you plan on getting Miller back? My plan is that we try to come to an agreement with Rachel. If she says no, we'll attack with force. Do you think that's possible? Possibly. We took over the rails pretty easily. This shouldn't be much harder. Yeah, but during the real battle, we had attacks from the inside and the outside. It worked, and surprisingly, we didn't lose one soldier. Why can't we do the same here? Because 
all of our soldiers were either lost or killed during the battle when Veronica attacked. So, you're saying it's five people against an army? Yeah. We can do it if we play it smart. Me and Ellie can do something else when we get inside the battle. You'll understand. Alright, just keep me updated. Let's see what you're hiding, Maisie. I'm not hiding anything. Sure. Anyone here? Step away, Veronica. Who are you? My name is Tyler Anderson. Do you know him, Maisie? No. I don't know you guys either. I know Veronica though, kinda. I hear her name all the time. What are you talking about? None of your business. Okay, Mr. Cool Kid. Who else is in there? I'm not going to tell you. Then it looks like I'm going to have to kill you to find out. Go ahead and try. Veronica, stop. He's just a kid. You can see that. Don't. Whatever. Commander, Rachel has news for you. She just sent in a transmission. What did she say? She had good and bad news. What's the good news? She has someone for you. And what's the bad? It's not Grant Ford. Ugh. Tell her she failed me and tell her I'm not happy. Sure thing, Commander. Stop! Now who are you? Doesn't matter. Mark, don't! Get back, Angela. Keep the kids safe. I know you, Veronica. The lost child. Shut up. The forgotten one. Shut up. The daughter who murdered her father. Shut up! <laughs> Veronica, don't! Shut it, Maisie. Veronica, stop! Now you can all die. Have fun saving yourselves. No! Veronica! Maisie, get in the car. Let's go. Come on! <coughs> Everybody get out! <coughs> Come on! I want to speak with Rachel. Rachel says she will not speak. I want to speak to her now. You're speaking. Rachel? Well, well, well. Grant Fort. Yeah, it's me. I'll get you to Veronica soon. You are the only person she wants. Why does she want me so bad? No clue. I just do my job. Well, she's not getting me. We'll see about that. Anyway, Rachel. I want to strike a deal. What deal? Give me Miller, and I won't kill you. Oh sure, yeah. No. Do you think I'm scared of your little threats? I have an army. And what do you have? Yeah, sure. Whatever you think. You're not getting Miller. It's not gonna happen. Veronica has Macy. She'll have Miller. Then, she'll have you. Alright. What if I told you that your outpost is getting taken down at this very second? Huh? And we're back.
you doing now? I'm gonna put the items that I just want to get to good use. What were the items you were collecting? They were internal computing systems. What is that? It's the internal computing system. Yeah, what does that mean? Of our soldiers. What? I thought you knew this by now. Wow. Guess you don't know much. Your soldiers have internal computing systems. Well, yeah. I mean, they are all just AI and code. Your soldiers? They're robots? They've always been robots, Maisie. How do you think we have so many soldiers? The answer is, we make them ourselves. Oh my god. Yeah, Maisie. Here, this will blow your mind even more. What is it? This is a bunker where all of our soldiers are built. It's easier to reuse the parts than buy new ones. I had to buy a stock of new ones from the reel a few days ago. That was the package I picked up. It makes so much more sense. Yeah. Watch. See, and there's a new manufactured soldier. Welcome. Yes, I serve Commander Veronica Fort, leader of the Woods Outpost. Very good. Miller! Huh? Let's go! Now! What did you just do? Hacked into their soldiers' internal computing systems. I brought them back. Made them ours. Wait, what? When they made their robot soldiers, the security wasn't made so... secure. So, Arnold or I can break the systematic mainframe with ease. The Raven soldiers... are robots? Oh yeah, I thought you guys knew that. I thought everybody knew that. What is this place? It's the lodge. The actual lodge. It's where I stay. Why are you taking me here? What's happening? I'll tell you what's happening. Your stupid friends are attacking my outpost. Yeah, I expected that. And guess what? Your friends are killing all of my people. Which is not okay. Calm down. You knew this was coming. I knew this was coming. Well, I might have to kill you. Because your friends are really a pain right now. 
First of all, they're not friends, they're family. Second of all, this was inevitable. You were always going to get paid back for your sins. It's that time. Shut up. You think I chose to be left by myself when my parents died? I was taken by the overlord and was trained to be who I am today. I'm not the proudest and I'm not perfect, but it's the best I could do with my circumstances. So don't tell me that I deserve this because I feel bad for every move I make that could be considered the wrong move. I'm just doing what I'm told by someone. That's someone who saved me from a life I miss, but I can't go back to that now. You wanted to know my backstory, Miller, but it's just torn and tattered with mistakes that I feel like I made. Where's Miller? He's up in that tower. It's where she keeps her prisoners. Oscar, you want to go get him? We'll stay down here. And defend? Sure thing. No, me and Ellie can do it. Leave Oscar down here to defend. You and Tulip, go find Rachel. Well, what are we waiting for? Everybody do their jobs. Crazy day, huh? Sure is. Where? Ellie? What? What was that? Ellie, you have to get off of here, now. What's going on? There's not much time. It's Rachel. She has Miller, and she's knocking us down. We can get off together, we have- We don't have enough time. What is that supposed to mean? I had my guided missile launcher on me from earlier, Ellie. I need you to get off of this tower. I can't leave you behind. There's no time, Ellie. I need you to get off of here. Dad would want you to. And we can't destroy what he built. One of us has to carry on. One of us has to carry on his legacy. Oh, God. can't be dead. No. 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 Ellie, are you okay? Where's Arnold? He's... He's dead. Oh God. It was her! Come back! I'm going to kill you. You hear me? I'm going to kill you. We'll see about that. Come on, Miller. You're going to Veronica.
Is that it? Is that all you have to tell me? Well, there's one more thing. What is it? You should be asking, who is it? Why? Hey, Maze. James? I heard you guys had a falling out. Too bad. I really did think you guys were kind of cute.